One thing I wish the world understood about people like me is that we're just like everyone else. I drive a car, I go to college, I hang out with my friends. I love to play music. I study for my exams like any other college student. When I'm hungry, I love to go to Wendy's. When I'm thirsty, I drink blood. Yep, I'm a vampire. Surprise! See, no one notices unless I tell them. And they have all these questions like, do you sleep in a coffin or do you have fangs or do you kill people? And I always tell them, yes, yes I do. Not I'm totally kidding. No, I don't have fangs. No, I don't sleep in a coffin. Yes, I drink blood. I'm a f***ing vampire. My parents have to keep me supplied, but it's kind of a far trip, so they just ship it to me. And they live in Transylvania? Texas. My mom works at a regional blood donation center. All vampires do. She swipes a bag now and then and sends it my way. Some vampires drink every day, but I'll just have maybe one or two glasses a week just to unwind. I'm not a binge drinker. Yeah, I've met a few other vampires here at college, um, in class and at some parties. You can always tell by their scent. Undetectable by humans, of course. But just like humans, we all have unique personalities, and I just haven't really found one that I want to be friends with yet. I'm sort of a lone wolf. No offense to my werewolf friends. But October's kind of the worst. Humans just don't get it. I mean, our culture is entirely misrepresented. You see little kids running around with fangs and cloaks and white face paint. I mean, I'm pale, but I'm not that pale. The blood looks real, I'll give them that. But everything else is a gross exaggeration. I just, I hate that the industry makes so much money off of inaccurate stereotypes. Honestly, October sucks. So, how do you know Cecilia? Uh, yeah, Cecilia and I, we're, we're best friends. Uh, we met a few years back at orientation um, and discovered that we, we share a mutual love for Wendy's. And what's it like being best friends with a vampire? You're a, va you're a vampire? <laughs> yeah, I guess I never told him about that. He's had a fun time with it though since he found out. Hey, um, what do you want for dinner? Uh, I don't know, the usual. Say it. Out loud. I mean, there's truth to some of the myths. The garlic thing is real. I can't go to Olive Garden or any Italian restaurant for that matter. Sunlight doesn't make me burn per se, but I'm extra sensitive to it. Beaches are definitely a no-go. I usually visit my aunt in Portland during the summer to avoid the inconvenience. The mirror thing is a myth. The main thing I want to get across is that vampires aren't that different from humans. We're very much the same. Except that I can turn into a bat. And you can't. <laughs>